All right, let's talk about your weather now because we have been enjoying the warm temperatures. At least I we had I had lunch outside yesterday. Yeah, I took a good long walk yesterday with the kiddos, and that's something that we need to soak up and enjoy because today is it for a while. Yeah, well, you, yeah, well, I mean, we're going to be looking at a big dip. Uh, when it comes to our temperatures this weekend, that'll stick around for a big portion of next week. We might not get back to the 80s uh, again this year. 85 in Pittsburgh yesterday for the high. Look at Beaver Falls, 87 degrees, 81 in Butler, Franklin also at 81 degrees. It was plenty warm outside. Sunny conditions, humidity levels are on the low side. So it was hot yesterday, but it wasn't, you know, kind of oppressive heat because humidity levels are low. For the first three days of the month, we have seen an average temperature. That means a high you're low, you add them together, you divide by two of 70 degrees so far. That's the hardest, hottest start since 2019, and we're expecting temperatures to be up in the 70s for our averages at least all the way through Thursday. So we have today another hot one, another hot one expected on Thursday. And if you look at that, the first five days of the month, what we are forecasting or projecting out to be uh, will likely be one of the or will, will be the hottest October start that we've seen since the 1950s. So it's going to be a while. Uh, the last time we saw temperatures this warm uh, and this really kind of pleasant to start October 84 uh, high temperature today. 16 mild conditions into the overnight hours. Here's those forecast highs for you again. Most places now will be into the 80s. I have uh, Pittsburgh and Beaver both coming in at 84 82 in Washington for your highs. Here's your forecast. How think things break down 1 o'clock 80 degrees 84 at 4 7 o'clock temperature right there at 79 and 10 o'clock 71 degrees. 60 is your forecast uh, or it's your temperature right now. I should say dew point coming in 56 degrees in the wind. It is calm at this time. Temperatures not too bad, especially because our winds are calm. So we're looking at most places right at or just below 60 degrees, including obviously Pittsburgh. Only concern we have, we do have the dense fog advisory, especially for uh, communities like Somerset, Bedford. I have seen some fairly thick fog even in Westmoreland County this morning. We'll go over and show you those visibilities. Greensburg's a lot better now, but they were down to zero just a little bit ago. Newcastle, half a mile. We are seeing that thick fog around the Bedford area this morning. So just kind of give yourself a heads up that there could be some fog that you're dealing with as you're heading off to work or school. Temperatures are going to be dropping over the weekend as that cooler air gets here with the upper low that we'll be tracking by. It's also going to bring us some rain chances. You can see them there uh, late Thursday into Friday. Really, I'm just saying Friday morning into Saturday with rain totals of around half an inch and temperatures. Number of places will be actually into the 30s on both uh, Sunday and Monday mornings. I actually have them in the low 40s in Pittsburgh.